it's too hot and I don't feel like cooking. So what do you do? This is Jackie from Motherwise, where I teach mothers and others how to get dinner on the table quickly. Today we're making a sushi rice bowl that requires no cooking, just some meal prepping. So let's get started. You'll need some rice. Now, I make my rice ahead of time. I make it at the beginning of the week, and then we eat on it all the rest of the week. When we have leftovers, you can always add rice to it to make a full meal. I'm making a California roll rice bowl. So I've got two cans of crab meat. You can also buy the fake crab meat in the sticks. I've got an avocado that's ripe and a big cucumber. So let's get started. So first I'm gonna open up my crab meat. And drain the water out. Now I have drained all of the water off and this is what we're left with and I'm gonna make two rice bowls so I've got two cans of crab meat because this is four ounces drained. I'm gonna go ahead and fix my rice in my bowls. I'm going to add my crab meat. Peel my cucumber. The avocado has a little bit of brown in it, so I'm going to remove that. And if you just use a spoon, you can get all of your avocado out. Now since my bowl is full and I want to mix everything together, I'm just going to put, put it in a larger bowl and stir it up. I feel like we need some more avocado. So I happen to have another one handy. I like to look at this better. Okay. You might also want to add some wasabi and pickled ginger. 
some soy sauce, and even some seaweed. Make your own sushi roll at home without the roll. It's delicious. And it requires no cooking except for prepping your rice. Enjoy this cool, quick, and easy meal. So here's our California roll rice bowl. So let's give it a taste. This does taste like a California roll. For the cost of a sushi roll, you get a whole bowl. This is Jackie from Motherwise. And remember, dinner's at